Hello, my friends, and welcome back to another episode of MTD here in North America. More specifically today, I am at Starreg, and I am with my buddy Tim. Tim is going to educate us on the growth of the sales team here at Starreg North America and learn about what their future holds and what's currently happening. So, Tim, thank you so much for being a part of MTD. Great. Thank you for your time today. Well, Tim, I know talking with you a little bit, you have been really all over the world and you've had some massive responsibility and some really, you know, sometimes complicated locations. And so it's a pleasure to learn from you today and learn a little bit more about what Starig is up to. Yeah, you know, it's really exciting times at Starig today. We're, we're expanding our market presence. Uh, we're just getting ready to open an office in Mexico, which is fantastic. We just opened an office in Wichita and we expanded our sales team. So even though 2021 has been a, a down year overall for manufacturing, we're really uh, getting ready for as the market turns around here. Well, congratulations on that growth, both Mexico and Wichita. So the location here in Kentucky is, is a really nice size, and you guys have kind of a, a live area where you can do some work for your customers. And we talked previously about the Bumotech series and how it's really high precision and one-off. But that's kind of the smaller world compared to what, what you work in, right, Tim? Uh, absolutely. You know, Bumatech is a nice, high-precision machine for things that are smaller than your, your wristwatch. You know, it builds gears, medical devices, implants. That's really the opposite end of the spectrum versus what I deal with. So the equipment on the larger side of Sterig will start about 20 inches, and it can go as large as a tank. Um, we have machines that are literally... 150 feet long, 40 feet between the columns, vertically, you're, you're talking 10, 12 feet. So really large equipment, but one key aspect is they're very precise, just like our small machines. That's pretty incredible to, to know that you can put something the size of a tank inside of the size of these machines, and you're still reaching the precision even from one side of this machine to the other in accuracy. Yeah, if you can imagine we have a machine in the defense industry where literally take your typical 30 foot room by 10 foot wide with an eight foot ceiling and you can position anywhere in that room within a piece of hair. Are you serious? Yes. Wow, holy moly. Well, I know when you work with that kind of precision and those size machines, it's not a commodity. So it's not someone's go buy a thousand of and just line them up side by side, right? These require a significant amount of resources, both from your sales team and from the service team as well. And so it's important for you guys to have really quality sales members, right? Absolutely. Our, our, our sales team has to have a lot of experience in industry. Uh, we generally like people with a, a very strong manufacturing background. Uh, on average, they're going to have a couple decades of experience in industry. And they're never the commodity guys. They're always the guys who are looking at the more challenging parts that have the highest demands, because that's where Sterling really succeeds. Yeah, well, you mentioned also that, you know, the last year or so has been somewhat of a struggle for, for a lot of people, a lot of companies, um, but you still managed to hire someone, one or two people new, right? And you're still looking to bring more people on board. Yes, we're always looking to expand our team. Uh, presently, we're looking for an application guy, actually, because what we sell is an engineered solution, and you need high-skilled application people to look at the part, process the part, and bring the best solution to the table. Uh, we added a Northeast salesperson. Uh, we just got a new West Coast guy as well, and we'll likely be adding more in the future. And you're the director of sales for North America, correct? Correct. I'm in charge of all North America, so U.S., Canada, and Mexico. It's quite the responsibility. And guys, for those of you who are interested in this soon-to-be or now open position, this is the guy you'll talk to. Tim is, you know, has an incredible vast database of knowledge and some of these things we can't talk about today because you've worked in such you know kind of secretive and also impressive locations around the world um, but I really appreciate that knowledge and the parts that you can share and the value that you said that your salesman must have you also present and carry in yourself I know that your partners and customers trust you a lot yeah I mean a lot of our relationships are, are very long-term uh, we always joke in our company, the big machines take anywhere from seven months to seven years for a project duration. So a lot of meetings, a lot of planning, a lot of detail, but at the end of the day, we deliver the best solution with the lowest cost per part that allows our customer to have unmatched productivity. 
seven months to seven years. So we all know that you're not in this for a short, quick buck. You are in this for the long haul and the people that you work with matter. Uh, absolutely. You know, Sterig's all about relationships. Typically a Sterig installation isn't just one machine. It always starts at one, but it can grow from there. Uh, one of our best customers in Oklahoma started a single machine and there are 10 machines today. Wow. I was talking with Steve and Steve was telling me that when it comes to service, you'll always get a human, which I think shows that it's important for both sales and service and all aspects of Sterig to really continue to remain human and not go, you know, here's a, a robot answering the phone right now to help you with your sales and service, right? So you guys really value that human aspect with all of your partners. Absolutely. And, you know, even when it comes to customer visits, even in the COVID times, you know, if a customer wants us there in person, we're going to be there in person. You know, today's technology, a lot of things are Zoom-based or Teams-based, but when that customer wants that one-on-one -on -one personal contact, we're there first, first thing. Yeah, well, Staric seems to be that, you know, that best kept secret, as I've heard other people say. And, you know, I've really learned a lot about these, these incredible machines. And I've said this word a lot, but I think it's, I think it's justified. I think some of what I've seen within the Staric group, and not just the machines, but the people themselves, it's really valuable and it's worth spending time getting to know and, you know, diving in to say, well, how can I be a part of that Staric family as well? No, absolutely. You know, what, at Sterog, first of all, we value the customer. You know, we always pride ourselves on machines that are reliable, highly precise, and the most productive. You know, we not, might not be the lowest cost machine on the initial investment, but the lowest cost of ownership, and also the best partner long term. Uh, if you go on YouTube, you can Google videos with Sterog customers where CEOs are giving us testimonials about our partnership. You know, I don't think many machine tool suppliers have that. No, you're right, and, and that shows to go, I like to say, instead of goes to show, but shows to go, yeah, the amount of years that you guys have put into this, and we know the history of, of Star Egg, um, even earlier than the 1900s, you know, and then coming to the U.S. in the mid-1950s, you guys have really dedicated a lot of time and resources and commitment to the U.S. market, to the North American market, and to your sales team. Absolutely. As you said earlier, we're one of the best-kept secrets in North America, but Sterig as a group has over 700 installs. You know, people don't realize that we actually have a really large footprint, but where we're at are the places that we can't talk about. Yeah, isn't that the truth? And hearing some of your stories, it's, yeah, I mean, you guys get to work with some of the most excellence on the planet, but sometimes we don't get to share those things, which is a shame, but dang on, Tim, what cool places you have been to. Yeah, absolutely. It's been a blessing. You know, I'm, I'm from Rockford, Illinois. I, I didn't travel until I was 20 years old. And since then, I've been everywhere in the world I can think of. And, you know, Sterig allows me to go around with the highest quality product and, and promote it. Um, you know, it's a, a different animal than, you know, a lot of machine tool companies. It's not commodity. It's application based. You know, we're a machine tool company that really is an engineering company that happens to build machine tools. It really sounds like something to be proud of in the position you're in. Um, it takes time and dedication to do that. And I know you're surrounding yourself with the best of the best in the industry. So I, can, I, I wish you all the continued success with that. And also, thank you for sharing and being a mentor for me and helping me learn a bit more about sales and the machines and the processes. So thank you also for being a part of MTD and allowing us to, to learn a bit more from you today. Great. I appreciate the opportunity. And I thank you for your time as well. Uh, it's a pleasure, my friend. Thank you.